It was here that just last night we... It was a guy on the news did it. So you're saying that the suicide was actually a homicide? Yeah, yeah. No, he was he was right. He was right there on the payphone, and he was talking to that kid that was up there. Hey, Tim. He was talking to the kid that was right there, and then he he kicked over a trash can, ran upstairs, tied off all the doorknobs, hey, <laughs> tied off all the doorknobs, pushed the kid off, and then took off in his car. So you're saying he was pushed? Oh no, he fell. Fell. Yeah, I'm not, like, look, I don't know. I don't want to sound like a creep or nothing, but I keep an eye on this neighborhood. And every night, that kid parks the car in the same damn place. Never have I ever seen some big, burly dude with a double-bladed axe stand out here, kick over trash cans and shit, and just lose his mind like he did there. Okay. Why didn't you call the authorities? I oh, thought someone else would do it. Interesting. Specialists state that this man is extremely deranged, delusional, and volatile. Do not approach him and do not make eye contact. Police urge that if you receive a call from an unknown number, do not answer it. Hey, 